Alright guys, it might look like a gray gloomy day here in the shithole town of South Austin, Texas here on this Monday afternoon April 29th 2019, but it is a glorious day in the life of Hambon Little Tail because I have just sold this little gas sucking truck. This will be the last video ever from my little gas sucking truck. If I can just make it alive. Of course, the guy that I'm thrilled to say is a Mexican mechanic who bought this and uh, he claims he will have this steering fixed for 50 dollars, amigo. 50 bucks. Uh, <laughs> This $700 steering repair is what uh, he said my mechanico is a ladrone. Anywho, that is his business, not mine. I just simply have to get this little truck from Austin to Kyle, Texas uh, without the steering going out. So I've got about... I don't know, 15 miles left to put on my little gas sucking four cylinder truck before uh, I begin my new life with my brand new better gas sucking truck. So of course, the 2500 is what I took for it. Now I paid 3500 for this truck three years ago. So let's see, I paid $3,500, I drove it for three years, put over 80,000 miles on it, and sold it for $1,000 less than I paid for it. So all in all, I think it was a successful purchase. Of course, it was the single bloodiest sale I've ever, this is the hardest I have ever spent buying and selling gas sucking trucks in my entire life since the day I was born and I have sold plenty of real estate uh, for a hell of a lot less stress on me than uh, selling and buying these gas sucking trucks and of course uh, somebody's gotten in front of us and I don't know where this dude Live, so I hope he realizes that I'm not behind him. Oh God, let this nightmare be over. The uh, woman at the DMV, she got a laugh when I showed back up. We had to do some special affidavit uh, since I had inked in the date last Thursday to sell it to those uh, guys from Salvador but as several people have mentioned to me that I probably saved my life uh, by having that deal fall through that those guys from El Salvador with all of the tattoos what exactly was I thinking whether it was 18 $100 bills or 28 $100 bills they were suggesting at that point, since I needed a ride home back to, um, you know, that these two Salvadorans with tattoos all over them, that I was going to get into the truck with them with somewhere between $18 and $2,800 bills in cash. And those nice young men were just going to give me a ride back home because that's just the kind of guys they are. So I probably save myself from minimally being robbed and probably being murdered so uh, I will just chalk it up to another learning experience but uh, my god has this eaten my life March 8th to April 29th oh lord guys so now that I'm no longer buying and selling old pickup trucks. I guess your old doomsday prophet can get back to talking about the collapse of a planet. Oh, man, that's what I'm going to miss about Austin, Texas. Or the little joggers. Uh, two 
weeks I'm on the road to New York, baby. New York, baby. In two weeks. See y'all soon in New York. <laughs>